Looking forward to Pop News now with Lara. Thank you, Robin. Yeah, good day for Pop News. Good morning to you. We begin with a GMA exclusive for you. Vanity Fair, thank you so much. Giving us and you the first look at their 25th annual Hollywood issue. There it is. You're seeing it first here. As always, the cover featuring the stars of the moment. 11 of them in all, from Chadwick Boseman to Sir Ronan, Henry Golding, and Ms. Regina King right yes. there. Yes. Just to name a few, not leaving any just enjoy the visual candy there. Inside, Bozeman says, quote, the actors who are within the pages of this issue give new breath to what Hollywood is and what Hollywood is going to be. I love that. It also, yes, it also includes a look back at the original Hollywood issue from 1995. Feast your wow. eyes on Nicole oh, wow. Kidman, Gwyneth Paltrow, Sarah Jessica Parker, featured among the celebrities there. Clearly, Vanity Fair knows what they're doing when they pick these people. The Vanity Fair 25th Annual Hollywood Issue hits stands this Tuesday's always a great read just before the Oscars to catch up on the inside scoop. A big congratulations, as you guys were talking about earlier, to our friend Carrie Underwood and Mike Fisher. This morning, they welcome their second child, Jacob yeah. Bryan. She posted these photos on her Instagram, mm. and there's, oh no, that's not Big Brother. That's Big Daddy. Big <laughs> Daddy. <laughs> there's Big Brother. Uh, Isaiah meeting his new sibling. Carrie reportedly doing great writing. Our hearts are full, our eyes are tired, yeah. and our lives are forever changed. Life is good. Mm -hmm. And, yes. Life also about to get very busy for Carrie and her new backup singer Jacob as they head out onto her Cry Pretty Tour 360, ironically named, uh, when it kicks <laughs> off May 1st in Greensboro, North Carolina. Hopefully, a lot more sleeping than crying. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 absolutely. Yeah. And I'm sure she'll be here all the time. Mm -hmm. um, I thought this was interesting. If you're someone <laughs> who sometimes runs late, um, <laughs> down on yourself. This story is for you. The early bird may get the worm, but it looks like the latecomers tend to be healthier and live longer. Yeah. Sorry, George. Yeah. Sorry about that. about that. <laughs> so the study out of Harvard. Well, uh, not just a pop news that's investigation. Well, yeah. well, one in the same, George. Uh, <laughs> the study found that those of us who tend to run late also tend to be more optimistic, thinking we can do it all and yeah. squeeze it in, squeeze that one last yeah. thing in before yeah. getting to someplace on time. Researchers say that positive outlook leads to a lower risk of disease and a longer life. That I believe. I'm a little yeah, long time. <laughs> <laughs> I know, Michael and I, we're good. We're good. <laughs> Uh, and finally, this year, Valentine's Day, it just won't be the same. Well, quite the same. For the first time since they made their debut in 1866, Don't these say cute it. sweetheart Don't candies with it. little sayings like kiss me and hug me, they will be nowhere to be found. Wow. The makers, Neckos, went out of business last oh. year, sold oh. off the classic candy line. The new owner says they just can't produce enough in time. It took oh. Necco, I didn't know this, 11 months to produce the 8 billion hearts a year that it made. The Spangler Candy Company, the new owner says, fear not though, my darlings. Sweethearts will be relaunched in time for next year's Valentine's okay. Day, Robin. Okay. That's a staple. That's a staple of Valentine's Day. I would like to suggest maybe they add a couple of new sayings like missed you and absence makes the heart grow fonder. Oh, nicely <laughs> done. Drop the mic, Robin. <laughs> <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.